About one in eight women will develop invasive breast cancer during their lifetime. A plant-based treatment for breast cancer is currently being researched in nearby Owensboro. If I can show that it can stop breast cancer growth, I have now uh, environmental friendly plant-based treatment for breast cancer. That's the goal of Dr. Chandra Imani, an assistant professor of plant molecular biology. He's conducting research on the basil plant at Owensboro Center for Business and Research. Basil is a plant which has a lot of compounds called metabolites, meaning the leaves of a basic basil plant, like any other plant, they make a lot of stuff. One of those important compounds has a very great pharmaceutical value because it's shown to control breast cancer. That compound in basil is called eugenol. Using a $12,000 grant from WKU's Office of Research, Imani and his students are genetically engineering the basil to produce more eugenol. If I make it make higher and higher amounts of eugenol, that plant, that basil plant, will be a storehouse of that anti-cancerous compound. Imani says a proof of concept experiment has already shown what eugenol can do. When they put it on a plate where there were tumor cells, it stopped the growth of the tumor cells. He calls this grant-funded research a huge stepping stone in treating cancer in a holistic way. By doing this research, uh, what I'm doing, people will now know that there is a biochemical basis to it so that they can do clinical trials and uh, try to see if whether this is a very effective way of getting a pharmaceutically important compound from a plant. If this phase is successful, the next step would be to get additional research funding that could lead to clinical trials. Dr. Imani's lab is located at the Owensboro Center for Business and Research, a business accelerator and research facility that opened in 2010. With this week's View from the Hill, I'm Amy Bingham.